If hiking is your thing and you're struggling to find sunglasses because they're all too big, stick around. I have some recommendations for you. Hello and welcome, I'm Eyeglass Tyler. Today I'm going to be reviewing our top picks for hiking sunglasses for smaller faces. It can be tough for us sometimes, our smaller faces, to find sunglasses that work well, that we like how they look, they perform well, and they fit properly. So if you have a smaller face and you've been struggling, I have a range of sizes here available that should suit your needs. These five frames not only look great for hiking, but have great everyday looks as well with performance features that enhance your hiking experience. In addition to styles that perfectly fit small faces, these also have an innovative frame material. All of them are going to have some kind of uh, better quality frame material that's gonna be more durable, usually lightweight and flexible. It's gonna stand up against normal wear and tear, usually even more rigorous wear and tear generous coverage, which is gonna give you sun protection as well as full visibility. Grip is usually an ideal, either in the temple or in the bridge, or ideally both. Only one of these doesn't, I'll get into that in just a moment. Uh, but also a cool thing is that all of these can be made in prescription. We take care of our prescription wears, so keep that in mind. If you do wear a prescription, we got you covered. If at the end of this, you're ready to order, you are interested, don't forget about SportRx. Definitely don't forget about that C better guarantee, because with that, you're never stuck with something that you don't like or just doesn't work for you. You have as long as 45 days with them even if you get them in prescription. You try that out, you figure it out, you reach out to us, we take care of you no matter what that means on our end. Also, by the way, we have opticians who are trained, friendly, knowledgeable, who'd love to help you get it right the first time. So you can always reach out to us and we can help you. All right, well, let's get into this. First up, we have the Nike, it's the Nike Dash. So this is the one that I mentioned, doesn't have any grip. One thing, and in terms of grip, is in grip material. It doesn't have any grip uh, material, no rubberized material, no grip material, either on the nose or uh, in the temples, unfortunately. However, in the temples, they did design this kind of textured temple tip design that does help to directionalize moisture, helps to keep uh, moisture away from that area a little better where it makes contact so that it can do a better job of gripping on your head, but I mean, it, with its high tension hinges and with proper fit and with the straight back temple design and the way it hugs the face, shouldn't be a concern about these guys slipping off anyway. Just something to be aware of. This does have a proper eight base wrap, so it is a nice wrapped lens. Really good, every time I look at the dash, and this is actually a part of a family of frames that Nike makes. There are two other frames of uh, an increasing size. This is the smallest one. It's just a really good straightforward wrapped sunglass. If you're like, I just need a good wrapped sunglass. I don't even think about it. I just want it to be wrapped. I want it to be a sunglass. Boom, Nike Dash. That'd be a great option for you. Very lightweight, durable nylon frame material, very impact resistant uh, lenses. They are polycarbonate. Even in the non-prescription version, you can get those Nike Max optics in the non-prescription variant. If you do need prescription, then you're gonna be looking at us and we can help you with our sport optimized lenses, which we have an amazing collection, assortment, a bunch of different options of lenses for you that are fantastic. And again, if you have questions about that, our opticians would love to help you. So this is a really straightforward frame. There's not too much more to say about it than that. This has an SFW of 121 millimeters, which lands you at a men's extra small and a women's small. Next up, we have an Oakley, and this is the Turbine XS. Uh, really what they did, if you're familiar with the Turbine, if you're familiar with Oakley, they just made it smaller. It's pretty great. Everything that you had in the Turbine, you have in the Turbine XS, just in a smaller form factor. Nice, obviously, o matter frame material, extremely lightweight and durable, very, very flexible, as you can see. Grip all over the place, lots of grip on the inside of the temple where it touches the side of your head, as well as where it touches your nose in the nose piece. So they're unobtainium grip material, which is gonna help to keep it uh, actually grippier even as you sweat, even as it gets wet. It doesn't uh, actually slide more, it grips even better. 
Thanks to their three-point fit system, you don't have to stress about how they fit on you. You just put them on and then you get to forget about them. When it comes to lenses on these guys, their Prism Lens Tech is still one of our absolute favorites. But what's cool is that it's also available in prescription. You can get that Prism Lens Tech in prescription as well. When it comes to fit, this has an SFW of 125 millimeters, which lands you at a men's small or a women's small to medium. Next up, we have a native. This is the native Penrose. This has been making it into a, quite a few lists recently. Native is a really cool brand. They're a little more in touch with uh, uh, being eco-friendly and they use their bio-based plant resin frame material, which is, it looks really good. It feels really good. They do this cool like uh, tri-laminate frame construction, which gives you some cool options in terms of colorways and everything. Uh, here you can see like white in the middle and then more of an amber on the inside and then a tortoise on the outside. Really cool uh, kind of fun features that you can get thanks to that. It does feel really good quality as well. Uh, so it's it's nice. It's a frame material. It's a, it's a, it's a company with a conscience really is what you're getting here when it comes to you know being eco-friendly a little more of a square lens design in this they do have a keyhole nose bridge which i tend to like tends to be a little more versatile in terms of bridge fit it does have grip on the temple it has grip in the nose and it is another good hydrophilic grip material, which is gonna to help to grip better. Even as it gets wet, you get in non-prescription, their premium polarized native lenses, which is pretty cool. That's a standard for them. Uh, in prescription, they don't have any authentic lens lab option, but again, you can count on us. We're gonna take care of you with our sport optimized lenses. This has an SFW of 125 millimeters, which lands you at a men's small or a women's small to medium. Next up, we have another Nike. This is the Maverick Small. So this is actually a part of a whole family of frames that they call the Maverick. It's a Maverick family. So there is a classic Maverick. So kind of like the Turbine, this is a classic Maverick, just the smaller down version. Smaller down version. Yeah, it's smaller down. <laughs> It is a six base frame, so a little more of an everyday uh, kind of appeal to it. This is probably the most uh, athleisure frame, I would say, on this desk. It does lend itself well to all around everyday use, but it looks really good, performs really well, uh, even in more aggressive athletic use. Uh, lots of grip on the inside of the temple here. Extremely flexible uh, injected nylon frame material, especially here at the ends of the temple tips. They do have this bridge design. It is this, uh, they call it a floating bridge design, ventilated floating bridge design. I always mention it when I look at these frames because it's a good concept. It is a good design for people for sure, but not for everyone. So it is more of a saddle style bridge, which I always love because it gives you more dispersion of weight because there's more surface area, but there's also more surface contact. So even better grip, all good things, but it's a little more rigid. It isn't quite as forgiving in terms of fit. So if you've had trouble with bridge fit in the past, keep that in mind if you're looking at this frame favorably uh, because that might be a concern. Otherwise, a really, really solid frame. When it comes to sizing, this has an SFW of 130 millimeters. And last but not least, we have the Maui Jim k &I, and this is an interesting addition because it is the largest frame on this table. Maybe uh, usually just by the SFW alone, I would think a little outside of the range of a small fit, but thanks to the shape, I think this definitely still suits a smaller face really well. A round lens is a little more forgiving. I think that uh, a larger face can wear a round lens even if it looks a little smaller because that's kind of the look. And a larger face uh, and a smaller face on the other hand can wear uh, maybe even a little bit larger of a round and it still looks good. This is another six base lens curvature. So it is definitely a frame that will suit you very well for all around use, but definitely really well while you're hiking the trails. It has an adjustable nose piece, which is the only option on this desk with that option. And I love it. And it is very uncommon to find in a plastic frame as well, or uh, nylon is a specific type of plastic, but I'll, I'll get into that in a second. Uh, but it does have adjustable nose pads, which is uncommon and I love it. 
but it's so crazy lightweight. That is the absolute first thing you notice when you hold this frame. It's just like you're holding nothing. So you put them on and you can totally forget that they're there. They have traditional pin hinges because that nylon material is so flexible. You don't have to stress about it. And of course, we're talking Maui, so we have to talk about their amazing lenses. Their polarized plus two lens technology is fantastic. Uh, you really can't beat it. I usually don't push polarized lenses too terribly hard for hiking. I will say that there's something about the quality of Maui's lenses that is amazing. So amazing that I still think that polarized, if you're talking polarized plus two, is great on the trails. You are potentially going to, and I don't hear this nearly as much with Maui, but the problem with polarized, the idea behind us not recommending polarized too much for hiking is because polarized lenses usually are very dark, but also it is that because of the polarizing uh, filter, it can affect your depth perception, which makes it a little bit difficult if you're walking the trails to read the topography, uh, not really the case with the polarized plus two lens technology. An amazing frame here and definitely one that I can endorse. I also really like round as you can tell. And so I think that's a, a very cool kind of, maybe vintage is the right word for it style uh, that'll look good on and off the trails, but amazing. So this has an SFW of 134 millimeters. So like I mentioned, a little on the larger side, but I still think very uh, appropriate for smaller faces. That wraps it up for our top picks for hiking sunglasses for smaller faces. I hope now you have a few more options that you're looking at favorably and that you think will suit you really, really well. If not, maybe at very least you have a better idea as to what to look for. If you do like any of these styles and you are ready to shop, stick around for a moment longer because we'll have an easy to click shop now button. Also, if you're ready to order, don't forget about our See Better Guarantee. I really think it gives you a ton of peace of mind. It really is an amazing offer of of peace of mind. And if peace of mind is your thing, our opticians offer peak peace of mind. Again, I, I've talked about them like five, seven times in this video. And I think it's great. It's because I think it's great. I think that it is cool that you can call us, you can reach out and you have a knowledgeable tenured optician who is just ready to give you all their knowledge and help you get the right thing for you. So always know that you can reach out to us. Thank you so much for watching. I really hope this was interesting or valuable information. If so, throw us a like, you guys, that'll help us. You can find relevant videos over here. And if you are liking any of these styles, click this button right here. You can shop it right now. Also, I have new content for you. Check out this one here. If you haven't already, you should already be subscribed to us. Go check us out and uh, like us.